Hello, my name is Dr. Louis Sclafani, and I'm a licensed chiropractic physician. I'm also the health director for Medical Products Online. Please remember to ask your doctor before using any of these devices. Today we're going to talk about microcurrent therapy. Microcurrent therapy is a subsensory uh, electrotherapy that is used to help with wound healing, reduction of pain, muscle spasm, and other ailments similar to that. This is very different than TENS therapy, electromuscle stimulation therapy, or interferential therapy because the output of the electrical impulse is much lower than you would otherwise find with these other devices. Today we're going to talk specifically about the Micro 2. You'll notice that your device comes with everything that you need to get started. An instruction manual, electrodes, lead wires, a battery, and the microcurrent device, the Micro 2. If you open up the front, you'll notice this is where the battery is inserted. Please put the battery in with appropriate positive-negative orientation. It also has three output settings, 0.3 hertz, 8 hertz, and 80 hertz. There's a timer for continuous, 20-minute setting, 40-minute setting, and a, a start button. At the top of your device, there's a safety cap. There are two knobs which you would use to turn on each channel and then you can dial up the intensity. Today we're going to demonstrate a technique called interfering current technique. We're going to hook up the two channels and we're going to say that I have a bruise in this area of my arm. Um, there may be some swelling, some reddening, or even some blue color. Muscle spasm, pain, nerve irritation also exist. So we're going to take an electrode, hook it to one of the channels, and we're going to take an electrode hook to the other side of that channel, the other pole, positive and negative, and then the other channel we're going to take and again surround the point so that the channels, the positives and negatives, dissect each other. So this is one channel, this is the other channel set in crisscross mode. In acute conditions, we will normally use a higher output. So we're going to use 80 hertz. We're going to set the timer for 20 minutes. Then we're going to set the unit for approximately one half of the output. You may feel this, but you'll probably barely feel it. I'm going to turn it up to approximately four, and I'm actually feeling this right now. So now I'm going to bring it to subsensory, approximately down to three. I'm going to close the cover, close the safety cap, and then we will wait for the duration of the treatment. Now this will help to create a bioelectrical current which is approximately mimicking my own bioelectrical current. So therefore, at the uh, this is called microampere treatment and again this is similar to my own body current. We're going to wait the 20 minute period of time and generally speaking you may begin to feel pain reduction right away. If you don't, don't worry, you would repeat, the, repeat this for approximately 20 minutes. You could do this up to two times a day, and you could do this for several days in a row. I want to thank you for joining us today at Medical Products Online, and remember to ask your doctor if you have any questions or before using any of these devices.